It's finally here. The big night. After weeks of work, it all comes down to one last chance. I'm telling you, as battered and beaten as all these people may be, if they're not in each other's arms by the end of this night, well, they never will be. Oh, I just, I, I wish I could just shake them, you know, and, and let them know how lucky they are to have love in their lives. I, I wish, I wish I could just, <laughs> this is crazy, but I wish I could just stand up at the top of the highest building and, and, and just shout out that the, there's, there's nothing more important in, in heaven or earth than to just be able to look deep into the eyes of the one you love and, and tell them. And so many people are given that chance. And, and wow, it's, it's the ones that don't pass up on that opportunity that are truly blessed, huh? How long are these tests going to take to come back? They take as long as they take. Is it the doctors? Do they have an answer? Ben, would you get a grip? Why would the doctors be calling me when they're just down the hall somewhere? Allie, hey. Just checking in. How are you and Gabby? Yeah, we're fine. I'm glad you called us. I need to hear your voice right now. Yeah, yours too. How's Hope? She's in with the docs and the Hartmans, and we're out here with uh, cold coffee and stale donuts, me, Gabby, and... Valerie? Yeah. Yeah, we're still waiting to see if any of us are a match, so it shouldn't be that much longer. Well, my flight is out at 9, so um, I'll be there soon, okay? I can't wait to see you. Yeah, me too, baby. I really need you here. Bad. I need you too. I'll be there soon, okay? I love you. Love you too. Just one more thing that I gotta do before I go. Start bringing everything in. You, you know where the kitchen is. Don. Oh. Is Lucy here? Oh, easy. I just got here myself. Well, she said to meet her here. That was supposed to be over an hour ago. Well, you know, Lucy, she's probably getting her hair done or something. I told her last week to go Brittany with the dude. Yeah, well, people are going to start showing up pretty soon. She's cutting it a little close. Oh, please. As if she'd miss her special day for anything in the world. What? What do you mean? Uh, well, I, I mean, uh, well, you know Lucy, how she loves Christmas and parties. Uh-huh. Well, I was... Hoping to get her alone before everyone got here. Oh? It was just some yeah, important things I need to talk to her about. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I just bet there are. Excuse me? Oh, nothing. Look, I've just got to go check in those orders, so I'll Don. sign Lucy's name. Don! Is it me, or are you acting, well, stranger than usual? Must be this season, I guess. Where are you? That's mine. I, I got the window. <laughs> you didn't. Oh, sorry. Ladies and gentlemen, mm -hmm. we're closing the door. Okay. We'll be ready to leave as soon as everyone takes their Pardon me? Uh, don't mm -hmm. worry. I will settle down in, in, in just a minute. You know, flying and all. Um, mm -hmm. So, is this your first trip to Hawaii? No. Really? Me too. <laughs> you know, my, um, my Serena, that, that's my daughter, she decided to spend a, f a few days at Christmas, you know, with, with her dad, wanted to spend Christmas. That's okay with me, because um, I decided to do something I've always wanted to do, you know, go away, get away from all those people in Port Charles that just suck the life out of me 52 weeks a year. <laughs> well, and, and anyway, I, I had this uh, great big Christmas party thing planned with my fiancé my ex-fiance, and it's not gonna happen. So you know what I say? Seize the day. Find your own happiness. So that's what I'm gonna do. You know what? Merry Christmas to all those people in Port Charles. Merry Christmas and a good night to them, because they're gonna have that party without me. It's my party. If I don't wanna show up to that party, I say I don't have to, right? I'm gonna show them. I will just show them all, don't you think? Ha. I want you to be honest with me. I, I, I really want your opinion. I mean, you are a man, right? Whatever you say. Right. So, I mean, now, now, now that we've established you're a man, you can tell me, how is it possible that a guy, a man, can say, I love you madly, I'm in love with you, and then the next minute be making eyes at another woman? It doesn't make any sense, you know? Not that me and Doc, you know, us, we have, we've had our problems at all. I did sleep with Ian. I admit that, you know, and, and I, I think we were working through that. There were reasons, but I'm a sucker. It's, it's, do you see what I'm saying? I am a big sucker, right? Uh, be brutal. Just hit me in the face with it. Say it. I am a sucker. Don't say it. No. 
I, I'm, I'm, I'm not. I'm just, I was just hoping, you know, that Doc was gonna do it. You know, we were finally gonna get married, but... Oh, I'm a chump. Say that. You are a chump because you're not gonna show up, though. I'm not doing it. I'm not gonna show Miss up that misery. Miss Headphones, no? Doc say he loves a, a, another woman and make a fool of me. Any with you? No, heck no. I don't... I've seen that ridiculous movie. It's no good anyway. You know, the wife does the murder. She kills him, so I, I, I think it stinks. Just like the party's gonna stink, right? Don't you feel that? It's gonna be the biggest dud that Port Charles has ever seen. I'll show those people. They're not gonna have me to kick around anymore, you know? Ta and double, double ta. And if Doc wants to hang out with that scarf-wearing slut, let him. I don't need him, never have, never will. I'm gonna have the merriest Christmas I've ever had, you know, in my whole life, ever. <sighs> ever! Yes, yes, it just go through there. Talk to Don, he'll sign for everything. Why do they have to deliver everything at the last minute? Lucy! Hi, Kevin. Hey, Serena, oh, look at you. Oh, hey, wait a minute. Lucy told me that you weren't going to... That I wasn't going to be here. Yeah. Because I was going to be with Dad. I still am for the rest of the holiday, but I talked him into letting me come here. I'm glad, because you know what? Your mom's going to need you tonight. You mean to help? I mean because she loves you like nobody else in the world. You and me, you mean. You better get dressed, and I'll go check on the GPs, okay? GPs. GPs? Oh, grandparents. Right, right. Okay, kids grow up. People change. I guess everything does. Did I hear change? As in, maybe you should, Dr. Collins? Uh, yeah, so everyone keeps reminding me. Is she upstairs? And waiting. Tell her I'll be right up then. <sighs> this isn't how I wanted to do this, Lucy. You're not dressed. I, I, I mean, of course you are, but not, not for <laughs> yeah, the party. This huh? time. <laughs> um, actually, no, I, I'm, I'm not going to the party. Oh, oh. Yeah. You'll miss the grand finale. I'm, I'm gonna take off for Chicago. But I, I didn't want to go without telling you how much you've, uh, you've touched my life. Uh, you know, Rafe, so many horrible things happen sometimes, and um, it's kind of hard to look past them. But I think that if I ever forget what a wonderful place this world is, I'll, I'll just think of you and, and I'll remember. Uh, th thanks. <laughs> you know, you're really special. You're, you're special to me. You're, you're the special one, you, more than you know. Wow, well, thanks for always making me feel that way. You know, it's just that whenever I'm with you, I, I sort of, I, yeah, uh... I'm, I'm sorry. I know you have to go to a party, so um, I, I kind of don't want to keep you. I just sort of wanted to say to you, you know that I... Don't, don't go. Yet, um, I still have a little time, and, and, uh... The end? Well, I want you to know what I'm, what I'm planning for the party tonight. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a big surprise. Well, you know that I love surprises. You're gonna love this one, then. You ready? Yeah. Oh, man. This is a killer. Uh, the Hartmans will let us know as soon as they can. I know we told them we'd wait, but I can't. I need to see hope. So you do what you want to do. I already learned that. So is there anything I can do? What, are you kidding me? You hopped on a plane and got tested, you have me? Well, what are sisters for? So you donate a kidney to some little girl you've never even laid eyes on, huh? That little girl is my niece, Jamal. And you're the one person who never gave up on me, even when I gave up on myself. What kind of a sister would I be if I said no? I won't forget this. Well, so much for that idea. Hey. What's up, household? Sleeping. I just peeked in and turned right around. How'd she look? So small. Valley, come here. Come here. Jamal. Come on, girl. It's gonna be okay, all right? Hey, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be fine. All right. 